Conservative historian Larry Schweikert is back with a new book about the Reagan presidency and a prediction for 2020. One America's Jack Posobiec sat down with the author to learn more. And we are very excited to welcome to One America News retired professor of history, Larry Schweikert, and also the author of the new book, Reagan, The American President. The American, yeah. yes. Very important we get that the in there. You have a theory coming up for the 2020 elections. And we saw uh, the 1980 election, the 1984 election of Reagan, which is a huge landslide win for him, almost won all 50 states, very, very close to yeah. winning 50 states. Now we're looking at President Trump. He had his win in 2016. What do you see happening in 2020? Is it going to be a repeat of 1984? Or is it going to be something different? I see whoever the Democrats nominate as creating a a third party candidate either to the right or to the left. If, it, if it's Joe Biden, you're going to have a revolt by the left wingers in the Democrat Party that will make Jill Stein look like nothing. I'm, I'm thinking three, four, five percent of the Democrat vote would go that direction. But if it's, if it's uh, Bernie Sanders on the other hand, you're going to have a, a centrist like a Howard Schultz run to his right and pull votes off that way. I don't see any candidate they have out there who can possibly get the so-called moderates, the, the union wing of the, of the old Democrat Party, and still appease the far left. I, I don't see them. And do you think that is the, the, the wing, or at least the one group that's really in play right now? It, it comes down to that. It's sort of the unions, the workers. The unions. And, and I don't think they're as in play as much as Biden thinks they're in play. Hmm. I, I think they're still fairly loyal to Trump. Look what he's done for them. He's the only one who's actually done anything for them. Uh, the Democrats have talked a good game. But he's actually come through for them. And to dial it back to the book, this is exactly how Reagan won. We hear this outcome from Pennsylvania. Right. We're constantly told about the Reagan Democrats, the Reagan Democrats. And I remember, you know, working on campaigns when I was younger and saying, well, why don't we try to campaign to those guys? Maybe you could win something. Well, and it's more than just the voters. You know, there, there were 40 or 50 bull weevil or, or blue dog Democrats in the House at the time that Reagan could work with and actually get legislation through the House. And I have one quote in the book where Tim O'Neill says, he's kicking my ass. <laughs> O'Neill was frustrated because Reagan could go right to his own base and say, I need your votes on these things because they will help your people. And he got them. Want to see more videos like this? Click on the link below and subscribe to One America News on YouTube and call your cable provider and kindly demand that One America News is added to your lineup. Call and subscribe today.